Hello everyone, thanks so much for logging on to CBS in Denver. It is time for your CBS in Denver daily sports line brought to you as always by BetMGM. Place your parlays, props and futures at the King of Sportsbooks. Download the app today. Coming off a good day yesterday, I told you I liked Ole Miss minus eight and a half and the Ole Miss team total over 39 and a half. Both of those cashes, they got a big win over Louisville yesterday to start their season. I think Ole Miss is going to be a lot of fun to watch this season. May have some more bets on them as we continue here in college football season, but a good start to college football season. 3-0 and and college football overall after a 2-0 and day yesterday. Let's get into today's game. The Rockies and the Giants playing game two of their three-game series out of Coors Field. Giants coming away with a 10-5 victory yesterday, and they are big-time favorites today. The Rockies, two-and-a-half run underdogs on the run line. That's paying out at minus 120. The over-under for tonight is 12, and for the Rockies to win, it is plus 170. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to give you a best bet today because I really don't like any of these numbers. I think they are too juiced, but if you had to pin me down, I would take the Giants on the run line at minus one-and-a-half at minus 140. Now, normally I wouldn't do that, but I don't like minus two and a half just in case the Rockies do something crazy late. They had a couple chances late in the game yesterday. Trevor Story had a two-run home run in the eighth that got it to within five. But I still think the Giants on the run line at minus one and a half would probably be the move. Again, you're juiced up a little bit, minus 140 on the money there, but I think that that's a safe play. I looked at the first five, but the Giants are minus 200 on the money line, and I'm just not willing to lay that price for the Giants today. Uh, a couple props to keep your eye on as well. Chichi Gonzalez is going to be on the mound for the Colorado Rockies. His strikeout prop is at three and a half. I lean under here. He's had eight home starts this season. He's only gone over three and a half strikeouts once in those eight starts. Again, that's juice two at minus 150. And then Logan Webb on the other side, his strikeout prop is at five and a half. I lean over here. That's paying out at minus 115. He's gone over in six straight starts, and one of those came against the Rockies in San Francisco. He had eight strikeouts. Last time he was at Coors Field, they only had five Ks, but I think Logan Webb goes over his strikeout prop today at five and a half. A couple leans for you as well on the NFL slate week one. We're going to talk more about this as the week goes on in some of our future editions of the CBS and Denver Daily Sports. I'm going to be talking some props tomorrow with uh, Pete from Props.Cash. We had him on a couple weeks ago talking NBA props. Now we're going to talk some NFL props for week one. They've got some fantastic stuff going on over there, so we're going to talk about that tomorrow. But a couple of my leans against the spread, where I am right now. Again, these aren't best bets. I haven't officially made up my mind here, but I'm leaning football team money line at home against the Chargers in week one. I'm also leaning Bills minus six and a half at home against the Steelers and Titans minus three at home against the Cardinals. I want to wait and see some of the injury reports that come out. Obviously, the Titans dealing with some COVID issues. So before I make those officials, uh, official plays, I'm going to wait a couple days here. But those are some of my leans. Would love to know what you hear about those. As always, you can find me on Twitter at MichaelCBS4. Okay, so that's going to do it for your CBS in Denver Daily Sports Line. I'm getting some weird eyes for not having a best bet. Give me Giants, minus one and a half on the run line, minus 140 as my best bet for your September 7th CBS in Denver daily sports line. There it is. Let's see if we can go 3-0 this week. All right, thanks so much for hanging out with us. We are, as always, brought to you by BetMGM. Place your parlays, props, and futures at the king of sportsbooks. Download the app today.